to product reviews, <laughs> I got the word giveaway in my mind. So we are both live on Instagram and YouTube. So if you're new to this live show, you're going to see my eyes go back and forth because I'm talking to two different platforms, okay? So before we get started with the products that I use for 2022, I just want to outline how our live shows normally go. I do my little spiel first, and then I talk about like the giveaways that we're doing for 2022, and then we're going to end with some updates that I have for you guys about the live show, okay? Now, this is an interactive live, so if you are in the live chat, definitely say hello to everybody. Welcome each other in. I normally don't look at the chat until I'm done with my little spiel because I can't read and uh, talk at the same time. That's it. That is it. Um, so if you have any questions for me, post them in the live in, I mean the live chat, and I will like get to them in just a second. And if you are on the replay, thank you for stopping by. I really appreciate it. So let's stop wasting time and let's get into it. I actually want to start with a positive note today because I got a lot to say about these She Sense It products. <laughs> good and bad, good and bad. And I wouldn't... Well, I was going to say, I wouldn't necessarily say bad, but I will. Um, but a lot of good things too. So, for the first product that we tried for March 2022 is the Curl Story Hydration Therapy uh, Multi-Use Conditioner, okay? And I am not new to uh, Curl Story. Curl Story is not new to this channel. You all heard me mention her hair butter on the channel before the owner is actually a part of our my natural hair life facebook group which is exciting so i love her uh cream however i really love this deep conditioner like seriously love well it's a multi-use conditioner i used it as a deep conditioner with expensive products like this and she's not technically expensive but I'm cheap, okay? With expensive products like this, I do not use it like as a rinse out. Uh, what's the other one? The rinse out, the deep conditioner, and a leave-in. I did not use it as a leave-in. Now, I would definitely try to use it as a leave-in for April 2022 and then give you guys my feedback. But this was so good. I saved just a little bit because I want to compare this to like my A1 deep conditioners and... Those are the Curl Smith Hydro Cream Soothing Mask and the Maui Moisture Shea Butter Hair Mask. Now, these are not on the same level as far as price wise, but as far as like results, um, I think they're on the same level. Like, both of these products are so amazing, that's why I call them staples, right? Which is why I want to compare this Curl Story Hydration therapy deep conditioner to these two i don't know which one is going to work best however i can say hands down hands down as far as detangling in the application goes curl story definitely have these beat like definitely have these beat and that's because this curl smith hydro cream soothing mask is a really really thick product okay really really thick product and this maui moisture mask is not too far off and if you are new to this channel hi you should know that i technically as a 4c natural do not enjoy like thick products like i feel like my strands are just too fragile for thick products but these two remained in my stash because the results are just phenomenal like seriously and that's exactly how i feel about this curl story hydration therapy mask and i'm gonna let you guys know like my comparison in april 2022 because bomb bomb dot freaking com like seriously now moving on i feel like okay let me back up for a second when i tried this mask i used the she sent it papaya scalp renewing shampoo and i don't like this product i do not i do not not even just a little bit let me tell you my hair was so freaking stripped after using this shampoo like 
no. And I even tried it on a person, a person with like three type hair and oh my God, no, 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 no. Like if you are looking to dry out your curls and I'm not even saying like clarify, right? Because every now and again, you do need a good clarifying shampoo, but I wouldn't. I wouldn't recommend this at all and that's sad because I do like a lot of she scented products not her deep conditioners <laughs> let's talk about that but this is an absolute no it's not even like I'm gonna think about it so I used this shampoo before I used or tried the curl story uh, hair mask and that's how I know that this is a really really good product because my hair was so stripped I was so mad <laughs> we're not even gonna go there okay so still on she sent it okay so for the month of March I used the she sent it um marula uh, miracle melt mass or line right her collection here and I got some good things and some bad things to say about she sent she sent it okay now, I don't, I came to the conclusion, let me say this, I came to the conclusion that I don't like She Scented Deep Conditioners for deep conditioning. I don't like it at all. Y'all know last uh, month I tried the uh, Royal Honey, Honey and Argan Hair Mask by She Scented, and I got the same results um that i did from this hair mask to this hair mask like seriously the same these products are great with detangling like the slip is there like oh my god like truly i love these products for detangling as far as deep conditioning though no like my hair felt like i just shampooed and not just my hair my son's hair my daughter's hair my son Timothy hair was a little bit like it was it was it felt better than ours is what I'm trying to say but it still wasn't good so I will repurchase like her deep conditioners for detanglers in that only like that is it I would never <laughs> I would never use another deep conditioner by her um because the first two products were like no, I got to deep condition again. And honestly, I'm just not willing to like waste any more time with like deep conditioning with uh, She Sent It. So that's that. Also, I tried the Passion Fruit and Flax Choco uh, Scalp Detox by She Sent It. And I don't know how to feel about this product. So this product says that it's supposed to clean your hair and your scalp. It's supposed to relieve like itchiness, right? And it's not supposed to leave your hair stripped, okay? So as far as like did my hair feel stripped after this product? No, okay? Did it soft itchiness? I can't answer that because I don't have itchiness. Like... I had scalp issues when I transitioned from being relaxed, right? But I fixed my scalp issues. And to date, because I regularly shampoo, right? I don't have scalp issues, so I can't speak to that. However, I did feel the need to shampoo after this. Like, I appreciated that it didn't strip my hair like this product here. Like, I appreciated that, right? But I don't feel like it completely cleaned my hair either. So... You all let me know. You all let me know. When you use a detox, is it supposed to clean your hair? It says cleanse on the label, but I'm personally confused about that. And because I'm confused about it, I will not repurchase this. Um, I feel like it's an extra step that I personally don't need. If you have like an irritated scalp, I can't even help you because... You know, I'm just not going to mislead you like that. I'm just saying. I'm just not going to mislead you like that. So, we just going to keep moving. So, with the uh, She Scented Marula uh, Moisture Rich Milk, you know, this collection here, I did try the uh, hair milk, the leave-in, right, and the hair cream. So, here's what I got to say 
about she scented products just in general right y'all know again i tried this line oh i tried this line last month in march or this is march no february right <laughs> i tried this purple line in february and i feel even though the ingredients are not like the exact same right i feel like these products feel the same way like these leave-in conditioners feel the same way the hair creams feel the exact same way i feel like i got the same results from both collections good and bad in my book good because i didn't get bad results right like i still think that these are like quality like great products right but bad because there's no difference like what's the point of having a separate line if i get the same results that is my thinking in my head y'all let me know if y'all tried these two collections did you get different results because i didn't i didn't and again i didn't sit down and go over the ingredients line by line but i'm pretty sure that a lot of the ingredients or the formula i should say i'm pretty sure those formulas are very very similar okay yes they listed on the labels but we don't know like the percentages as the buyer right as the consumer we don't know the percentages of like what these natural hair care brands are using so that makes a difference when it comes to like natural hair products the amount of a particular ingredient will make a, a hair product feel different than the others okay so that's just my two cents on that if i do repurchase she sent it i would say that i would buy more of these leave-ins because as you can see the leave-in run out or all all of her leave-ins run out so freaking fast and yes i do have a lot of hair but dang this is like this is like two uses you're telling me out this eight ounce eight and a half ounce bottle that i'm going to get three uses that's it and then i have like this full thing of <laughs> hair butter like seriously it's so freaking full it's ridiculous like i'm sorry it's a little hair now my bad but three uses and this is like what probably like 15 uses like that's ridiculous to me so i will repurchase this on sale because i i wouldn't repurchase it off sale because i feel the need to buy more but i will repurchase is my point so just let me put my uh empties in here and then we're gonna continue continue on with the new products that i use um for march 22 2022 so for my empties i had to include my staples y'all know allocate naturals black soap moisturizing shampoo is bae for me it's completely bae for me and i empty another bottle and i empty the aunt jackie's quench leave in this is also another staple for me and as you go along in your journey my new naturals right you're gonna find that you're going to empty only staples like you just go, you're just gonna be able to empty only staples and you're gonna eventually get to a point in your journey where you're not a, a junkie like you're not buying all these products because you're gonna find that you're gonna waste a lot of money doing that just want to put that out there but let's continue on so i also tried the negas banda moist hydration shampoo Whew. okay so i love negas banda not only do i love negas banda i highly respect the owner of negas banda and negas banda owner has supported this channel and i say all this to say that i'm still gonna give y'all my honest opinion regardless of our relationship this shampoo is so thick okay it is so thick i had to get an empty bottle put some water in it to dilute the product to get the product like work the product in my hair in my kids hair i've tried it on timothy my son also and yes i do feel like the product cleans your hair yes i do feel like it's a really really like quality product however it is extremely thick and again if you're not a fan 
of like thick products if you do not mind adding water to a separate bottle it will be completely fine but if you're not a fan of like just doing that extra step i just want to caution you that you dealing with thickness here right you dealing with thickness great product will i repurchase i purchased this one i did during black friday will i repurchase no i won't I won't because of the thickness, because of the extra work. Um, again, decent product, seriously decent product, but I personally will not repurchase. So I hope that helps. Again, just because we have a relationship, my, my opinion is my opinion. So last product before we get into these giveaways, and I'm just looking around my desk here. Oh, no, two more products, okay? We gonna end on... We're going to end on a positive note. <laughs> so as far as the other product that I did not like for March 2022, it is this raw sugar hair mask. No, ma'am. No, sir. No, thank you. This product is so freaking thick. Again, with the thickness, I don't know. Application was horrible, okay? just horrible i don't know no other word other than horrible okay um as far as like my results how did my hair feel my hair felt great afterwards right but that product is just too hard to work through like my strands and it's not worth it to me okay yes i like the results that it is what it is okay so the last product that i have my phone is about to die let me plug it up so we don't lose YouTube. One second. We don't want to lose them. And of course, my butt didn't realize that until now, which is not good. But it is what it is. Okay. One second, people. That cord not long enough. If you're on the replay and you stayed, <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Let me plug up YouTube really, really quick so we don't lose them. All right, sorry, YouTube. So sorry, so sorry. Boom. Okay, so we're not gonna lose YouTube. So, last hair mask that I tried for March is my soap box, this tea tree soothing hydration hair mask and i like it i do i do like it now if you are not a fan of uh the tree tea tea tree scent if you're not a fan of that scent i wouldn't suggest like trying this product because it is loud like it smells exactly like the name right and we expect that from all products but sometimes that's just not the case but this is loud the texture on this is amazing. It's really, really loose. I can't even tilt it over because it's so loose. And I think that's the reason why I love this product. Because it was easy to spread throughout my hair. The results were amazing. I don't remember how much I paid for this, but I got this from Sally's on Black Friday or Cyber Monday. One of them days. Uh, will I repurchase it again? I have to use it again. I only use this product on me. I didn't use it on like my family. So I have to use it again on my family. After I use it on everybody is when I declare a product like a staple or like something that I will like, definitely repurchase. Um, except for this right here. I, one person. I did two people. But... I'm telling you, one person was just enough. I'm so upset. If y'all don't know, I'm really upset about that shampoo. So, okay. So, let's talk about the giveaways that we're doing for 2022 before we go to the chat. If you are interested in the giveaways for 2022, if you are not new to the live show, please remember to leave your purple heart, okay? 
please remember to leave your purple heart. If you are on Instagram, you have to come back to the replay and leave your purple heart um, in the comments because after I end this live, I cannot see who was here, okay? If you are on YouTube, you can leave your purple heart in the live chat. I highly recommend that you come back to the live and still comment because sometimes I'm not able to view the live chat in special cases. Often I am, but I'm just saying, just in case, if you want credit for your comment, definitely do not get to leave your purple heart, okay? Now, for people who I don't know, or for people who don't know what I'm talking about, right? Like, what are the giveaways, right? You want to check out the description box to this video after the replay. I did a separate video talking about the ins and outs, what you can do, what you can't do when it comes to the giveaway. Um, or giveaways that we're doing for the full year instead of me doing the spiel because I felt like or I, I felt like um, Before it just made the video just too long. So check out the description box If you want the details for the giveaways that we're doing for 2022 If you are on Instagram, you can feel free well feel free to DM me the keyword giveaways and I will shoot you that information because I can't you know, it's just different setups between platforms. So, don't forget to leave your purple heart, okay? And we are actually going to see the prizes that people are going to win for March. Um, whoever the winner is going to be. The winner has not been selected yet because the month is not over. Um, but while I'm getting this, I just want to say, as far as the live updates, we are changing the dates, okay? There is no longer going to be three lives per month. Only because of personal situations, we're only going to have two live shows per month, okay? The schedule is as follows. We're going to do the first Sunday of every month. And we're going to do the last Sunday of every month. I feel like that makes it so easy to remember. And if you just forget... Right? You can always come back to any live replay and see the description box and I'll leave the details there. Or go to my about page on the homepage of YouTube. And again, it's going to be the first Sunday of every month at 12 noon Central Standard Time. And the last Sunday of every month at 12 noon Central Standard Time. So that means be here next Sunday because we're going live next Sunday okay so for the month of March we actually ran two separate giveaways okay we ran two separate giveaways one as the main giveaway that we do every month and the second giveaway was exclusive to the Facebook group at my natural hair life okay so if you are not connected with us on Facebook you definitely want to do that because in the Facebook group, we run exclusive giveaways just for Facebook, okay? If you um, are on Instagram, because I can't put the link in Instagram, DM me, blah, blah, DM me Facebook and then I'll send you the link, okay? That is exactly what you want to do. So, I got my live chat up here, but let's talk about these prizes for March and then we done okay so for the main giveaway the first prize is going to be by Nega's Banda the green smoothie anti-shedding rinse treatment whoever the winner is going to be will be receiving this product it is a full size product just FYI all our prizes will be full size products and then you're going to be receiving the uh, Kinky Tresses Coconut Mango Hair Butter. Y'all know, if you've been following me for some time now, I am crazy balls about this hair butter. This is num like number one to me when it comes to moisture. It definitely provides a definition too. However, if I'm like having a bad wash day, and some product just didn't treat me right, right? I turn to Kinky Tresses. I do. I turn right to her. And then, you know, she just hugs me, okay? So if you are part of the Facebook group, 
the winner is going to receive one of my curl smith uh calming conditioner this is a rinse out conditioner by curl smith again a full size product you'll be receiving that as soon as we draw um a name and then oh here we go the other product is by negas banda a deep conditioner by negas banda all right you guys again another full size product so two winners for march and oh just so y'all know curl story is sponsoring april's giveaway you are going to receive whoever the winner is going to be with curls uh april whoever the winner is going to be for april i can talk i went to sixth grade Whoever the winner is going to be for April will receive a $50 gift card from Curl Story. So if you're curious, if you uh, are not new and you still don't know the full details to how to participate in the giveaways, check the description box on the replay, okay, and see that video. So let's go to the chat on Instagram first. And then we're going to go to the chat on YouTube. It's a lot of people on Instagram. Well, it's five now. But y'all came through on Instagram and waved at least. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Hello, D from New Jersey. Good morning from Cali. Hey, Cali in the building. Oh my God, Mexico is in the building too? Wow. I only have like three friends here in Chicago and all these people like tuned in on Instagram. Like for real. Hawaii is in the building? Hi, Hawaii. All right, I see Rachel. Rachel is from Chicago. See, that's one of my friends. <laughs> oh man, thank you guys for tuning in on Instagram. I appreciate it so much. So Rachel says, when hair products are too thick, it just takes too much work to spread. Yes, and that's exactly like why I was so turned off with uh, raw sugar. I was so turned off. We, we're not going to dwell on it, but yes, ma'am, absolutely. Let's see. Okay, so Rachel loves the um, tea tree scent. It's loud, girl. It's so it's so loud. So R X C zero G A E. Yeah, I I'm not gonna like butch that pronunciation, but I see that you put a purple heart. Please make sure that you come back to the uh, replay and put the purple heart in the comments, please. New Hampshire is in the building. Oh my God, I'm calling my daddy after this and tell him that I have friends like all over the world. Like I'm seriously calling him. Okay, so let's look at um YouTube comments. Hey Nancy, Miss Hill, how you doing? Miss Johnson is in the building. Miss Campbell is in the building. Oh my God, thank you guys for showing up. I appreciate y'all, all y'all beautiful people. Okay, everybody just saying hi. Let's see. No oils. Oh, so I normally use my uh, DIY oil. I'm assuming that you asking me why I don't review oils of Life Adventures. So I normally use my own DIY oils. I do not purchase like other brands oils, right? Oil is not oil. Let me put that out there, right? But it's so much cheaper once you find the oil that works for you. It's so much cheaper and smarter financially to buy the oil yourself and then do your own mix. So, no ma'am, I do not have any oil reviews because I don't purchase oils from other brands. They send it to me and when they do, I try it and I'll get my feedback. But as far as uh, me going out my way to purchase an oil that's not happening you know what I mean so okay 
So Simone says she loves the Soapbox uh, Tea Tree hair mask. Yes, decent product. Like, really, really decent product. I was surprised. And I've never even, like, thought about buying this product. I've seen it, you know, on the Sally's website. And I was like, okay, let me get this product because it's cheap. And, you know, so that I can have, like, product in my collection to review for the channel. Um, but if I didn't see it on sale, I probably wouldn't get it. But I'm glad that I picked it up, is what I'm saying. Okay? Let's see. Oh, yes, ma'am. The sadness in the she sent it. Whew, we not gonna dwell on it. We not. We not, sis. We not gonna dwell on it. But, <laughs> I was disappointed. I'm not even gonna lie. Disappointed. Long Island, New York. Wait till I call my daddy and tell him that I got friends all over the world. Wait. I've often wanted to make my own oils, but don't know which one should or shouldn't be mixed together. Any advice? Yes, Miss Hill. So I'm actually going to do a video on like what to look for in the oils as far as will this oil clog your pores? Because that's what you want to look for, right? All oils are sealants, right? They're not necessarily, I know the message out here in our community, right? But all oils are one, not created equal. And they're not necessarily meant to penetrate like your strands. I know coconut oil do. I know olive oil do. But I'm just talking about oils in general. You want to use them as sealants. So I'm going to make a separate video detailing um what to look for how you can look up um certain facts about oil so that you know what to use okay let's just leave it at that i'll save it for that video that video is coming out um in april so it's not gonna be long before i do it but yes ma'am i would definitely help you out and we don't have any more comments y'all thank you for coming like on the live show we have hit 30 minutes y'all know i try to jump off after 30 minutes and we hit our mark we two minutes over but that's okay okay <laughs> thank you guys for coming to the live today and you all have a great a wonderful a blessed sunday thank you for being patient with me with um having to plug up my phone <laughs> and i will see you guys next sunday don't forget we're only doing two lives per month so the first and the last Sunday of each month at 12 noon Central Standard Time. I'll see you guys next Sunday. Um, and good luck to wh whoever the winner is going to be. Okay. <laughs> Thank you guys later. Bye. See you later, Instagram. See you later, YouTube.